Oh, 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 hello and welcome to Monday Night Raw. We are going to take just a second in memory of John Hubbard and Luke Harper. Um, welcome to Monday Night Raw with the main bills. I don't know when Ronnie's going to be here. He was shopping, so he should be here any minute. So, but rest in peace to Luke Harper. He had severe lung problems and he's been in the hospital since October and he just recently passed away we are very sad about it and um we are elijah loved luke harper he was one of the best for elijah and so it kind of makes us sad um but yes hello hello i hope everybody had a great christmas i hope you guys stayed safe and warm and all the peace cuddles and feels of the nice feels of Christmas. And uh, yes. How is everybody doing today? I think Ronnie should be here soon. He was shopping. He should be here very, very soon. I'm hoping he gets here very soon. I don't want to run the whole stream by myself. But yes. How is everybody doing? How was your Christmas? Let me know. I want to see. What did you guys get for Christmas? Did you just get love and hugs? Because we really need a lot of love and hugs for Christmas this year. What did you guys get for Christmas? We have this a little spoiler alert. Uh, my Christmas vlog is coming out on Wednesday. We have an announcement tomorrow on our other channel. A life-changing announcement on our other channel tomorrow. So go follow and subscribe to Hopeful Nation. But yes, we are. Um, this is a spoiler. We got. I got a dolphin blanket for Christmas. I think it's upside down, but it's really pretty. You'll see it on our other channel. If you want to know what we got for Christmas, go to Hopeful Nation. We're vlogging over there as well. We are starting a new series starting tomorrow. We're starting a new series on Hopeful Nation. So don't miss out on our announcement. Go subscribe to Hopeful Nation. If you guys want to know, go there. <laughs> yes, R.E.P. Brody Lee. Coffee is wearing off already. Dang. Oh, we sang one of your favorites. I'm not fond of that. Go tell it on the mountain, uh, Kayla, but I'm glad you love it. Uh, I'm sorry, Kathy. Yeah, there's been actually several people that I know that lost a loved one during this time of season. And we've got Mr. McIntyre holding the belt, walking down. Woo woo! McIntyre coming down the ring right now. Yes, I am all for this with McIntyre and the belt and the kilt and the um. Mhm. Mm yes, huge announcement tomorrow. Oh, oh no, Trip. I'm sorry. I actually like the movie Titanic. I just have to be in a mood to watch it. It's a good movie. I just have to be in the mood. A gift card from Chili's. Ooh, I want to go to Chili's. I love Chili's. New fuzzy soft blanket like me. Yes, Charlene. You got an air fryer. You have to tell me how the air fryer works, Adam. Merry Christmas, Ron Wild. Totally fine. And thank you for saying it now. We can say it all year around if you want. Just because he wants so bad, sing his scooter. Oh, $2 from Deb's McClude from Deb's Dreams channel. Go check out Deb's Dreams. Shout out to Miss Deb's Dreams. You go subscribe to her. She's a part of our family. Um, I guess Scooter really, 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 really wants to sing. So, ready?
the announcement video on our other channel to find out the details about that. Yeah, he was totally ready. You got a Texas Rangers t-shirt and a Montana State Bobcats t-shirt and a cup stack. Sweet, Courtney Cunningham. Shadow Two Puppy Choir. Yes, Shadow and Breeze were involved in that one. Hi, Nathan. Welcome. Ronnie won the tissue challenge. I know, Wally. Rude. A vood. <laughs> we definitely have a Christmas special coming out on Wednesday. We've got some vlogs coming up and a new YouTube series on our other channel at Hopeful Nation. I will be promoting it all throughout the stream. But I have to listen to what McIntyre is saying right now. Oh, Seamus is walking in. He is going to interrupt what uh, McIntyre is saying. Let me check my security cameras. Is Ronnie back home yet? No, he is not. I am waiting for Ronnie to get back home. He was shopping. I apologize that he is not here right now. Last stream of the year it is. We will see you all next year. <laughs> No, no, you're awesome. Hello, Callum. Good to see you. Hi, Cassidy. Hi, Sonny. Ronnie is not here at the moment. He will be here as soon as possible. He should be on his way home. Where did you get that awesome hoodie you're wearing? This is from, which website is this from? This is from Hopes and Dreams on Teespring. Is it Teespring or Spreadshirt? Oh my gosh. Post the link, Deb. Hopes and dreams. It says, inspire the mind, awaken the heart, allow the spirit to sing. If you would like this sweatshirt, go to Hopes and Dreams store. Uh, Deb will soon post it. You can buy one of these sweatshirts if you would like it. It's a hopeful dreamer shirt. Inspire the mind, awaken the heart, and allow the spirit to sing. You're more than welcome to buy one of those sweatshirts. Um... I'm going to Orlando in April and looking at houses. Awesome, Kayla. Good luck with that. I got Enema. Enemy of the State by Blink-182. Enema? Enema? Punk? Enema? Is it Enema or Enemy of the State? <laughs> Blink-182 and some 41. I think you meant to say Enemy, but that's funny. Yes. You got yourself a Hamilton calendar. Woo! I started watching Hamilton. I stopped it. I'm not into Hamilton. <laughs> Sorry. That's an awesome hoodie, Mel. Wonder where you got it. Thanks. Made it here for the last stream of the year. Yes, yes. You saw Church on Laptop. I'm so happy you guys are watching Church. If you're watching Word of Life streams, um, make sure you say hi in the comments while it's streaming. If you're there at the right time, make sure you say hi to everybody like you do here. Cause we're all hanging out in there too, unless I'm singing or on piano or something. Oh, and look who is walking through the door right now. Mr. Ronnie Mainville, New Year's Eve party. We are thinking about Anthony. And if we are, we're going to probably try to do it on Hopeful Nation. I have yet to go live on Hopeful Nation. And if you help me to get to 1,000 subscribers, that will help tremendously. So make sure you subscribe to Hopeful Nation so we can get live going on the other channel as well. Because there's going to be a lot of lives coming up with our new series on Hopeful Nation. Hello, Caden Tucker. Yeah, there's been a lot of people into painting lately. I got a replica of the Lightning Stanley Cup ring and a frame pick that won the cup. Oh, Valerie, that's amazing. I could do a Lafayette super fast wrap. It's so hard. Ooh, I'm going to have to hear that one, Miss AJ. Does your church have any t-shirts? I want one. We have sweatshirts. I don't know if they're online. I'll have to ask Dana, who's in charge of that. AJ, do we have any Word of Life shirts on um, the website? I'll have to check that out. And I'll let you know, um, Kayla. We have some seriously um, comfortable shirts. Oh, hello. What is up, everybody? Oh, you don't have to scream. You don't have to scream. Yes, the dogs are excited. What? No. 
No. No, I guess not, Kaden. Hi, Amanda. Good year. Santa also brought me SummerSlam 2020. And Ooh, Anthony. Nice. That is good. What are we doing here? So McIntyre came out first, started talking. Sheamus came out talking smack, and now it's Keith Lee. It's gonna be a it's gonna be a three way. Just watch. It's gonna be a three way. Well, McIntyre doesn't have to fight. He's the champ. I know, just for show. I think it's just gonna be for show. King of the Clan. Yes, yes. Punk Rock. Hello, Amber. I need to come over. Yes, AJ. Yes, do. If everybody notices in our last vlog, AJ Durgan is the one that gave us the picture on the last vlog. So make sure you guys all say hello to AJ. She's a friend of ours, local here. I know, Kathy. I've known her since she was born. So. What is up? Awesome, Jeff. That's Wrestling from a fan's perspective. That's I like Nathan. That. Nathan is the wrestling from. Will do, Valerie. Will do. Got a free. Dean, it ain't that late. Just, I mean, think about it. I made it. him. I made him drink some coffee, and he says it's wearing off. Well, there's always another coffee. <laughs> Ronnie, congrats. Oh, mute this. Congrats on the 25 years at work. You got a fee free PS4 Pro. Who said that? Wally did. Wally, you might want to rephrase that. She got a PS4. Don't make me feel Pro. bad for that. Rude. Listen, she really made out because if you guys remember, she said... That was my Christmas, Valentine's, birthday. The PS4 Pro was Christmas, Valentine's, birthday. And she still got birthday presents. What kind? I got Christmas presents. That's what I said. My birthday is not on Christmas. But you don't get no birthday presents. I don't have to do nothing my for Valentine's Day. My birthday present is flying. That's what I'm just going to say right now until you see the announcement tomorrow. I'm just going to say my birthday present is flying across America. Well, I so. thank you, Debs, Miss Debbie, Debs, Debs. You're, how, did you get a good nap? Kayla, She's probably going to fall asleep right after this stream, too. Can you all sing the Blessing Sunday? Kayla, I am not in charge of the worship. Whoever is in charge of the worship, I don't sing every Sunday. We have different teams, so I don't. No, I can try for you. I can put a little ear in Anthony, for the worship team, but I don't know who's leading worship this next I'll be Sunday. right back. I'm going to go light the heater, and I'm going to answer Anthony's question. We have like five different teams for a church, and, they're, and they, they rotate. So, I mean, I could put in a little suggestion, but I can't guarantee that will happen. Too much coffee at 1 a.m. in the morning. Is that a good thing? No, it's not because it gives heart palpitations. So you got to be careful with that. Hello, Marco. What is up? You woke up cold. You need a heater. You need a space heater. Can you get out of California? Yes, you can, punk. People could travel anywhere in the United States. I could drive across America if I wanted to right now. Anybody can travel. Um, you just got to keep your distance. You just got to wear your mask and keep your dis distance everywhere you go. We're not like locked in our houses. There's no martial law. It's not against the law to travel. I just can't travel out of the United States on an airplane. So, um, yeah, you totally can. You definitely need a fluffy puppy. Pu puppy? Fluffy puppy. Dad, you need a fluffy puppy. Oh, it's still commercial. There we go. Oh, I know. Choir practice. I'm trying to learn electric bass so that I can be the next bassist in church. Amazing, AJ. And I, I bet you, you will do amazing. You are very talented. Very, very, very. The whole Durgan family's talented. Just saying. What are you doing? What you got? Where are you going? Why are you what? What's okay. going on? What happened? So the, so the question was asked: Will they be in an arena with people in it in 2021? 
Here is my prediction. And it's early, so it What's could up, be Shamsher? wrong. What's up, Shamsher? My prediction is they will have limited fans at pay-per-views. Pay-per-views. They didn't spend all the all that money on the Thunderdome. How are you 80 pounds down in three months? That's not healthy, unless you had the weight loss surgery, Shamsher. But you're welcome. Uh, they didn't spend all that money. Or what they might start doing is charging. Charging, you know, I don't know, $5 for the, for the dome. I could see that happening. But I don't see fans coming in for normal Monday Night Raw SmackDown anytime soon. Maybe Mania, but... Hello, Rebecca Rizzo and... Uh, not sure. McDonald's is great, Wally. I enjoy working at McDonald's. And yes, I love my nacho fries, which I'll probably get tomorrow. So thank you for reminding me. And you me. better bring me some. What if I don't want to bring you any? Then there'll be mouth punches. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Nice guy. All right. Rebecca. Hope they got some point in the arena. No, I hope so too. I think they're going to ease into it because they did a lot of work on the Thunderdome. So I think pay-per-views, that's where they're going to start. Kaden, will you turn the oven on to 425, please? It could be the opposite. Pay-per-views, they don't in Monday Night Raw and SmackDown, but I don't see that happening because of the fact they have the Thunderdome set up. So if they wanted to travel to orange states, if you want to call it, with less COVID where they're spaced out, possibly. But I definitely see them possibly charging for the Thunderdome. It is 520 right now, Rebecca. Where are you at? What's up, Jared? Hope mm -hmm. you had a great time. Calm down, Karen. Victor, just, what's up, buddy? I haven't seen you down. in a while. Or at least I haven't got to talk to you in a yeah. while. Just calm down. You're rubbing your fur all Jared's over me. All about dirty. Yes, we did it at the very beginning. All right. What uh, you talking about, Willis? Yes. I know. There was yes. a huge line. When I came back from my doctor's appointment, huge line. I even thought about it, and I'm like, nope. Your breast stinks. Okay, calm down. Valerie, 38 is going to be in Tampa? Wake up, Dean! That is not... Wakey, wakey, shaky, piggy! Oh, you're in the UK. So is Dean, and so is Debs in Scotland. I've got some uh, friends in UK. Actually, 517. Sky, what's up? Well, now it's 518. Now, is this match right now to who's going to face Drew at uh, Rumble? Or is it just going to be an entrance into the Rumble, whoever wins? Did you get on okay at the docks and did you vlog it? I vlogged some of the doctors. Is your brain still in your skull? That's what we want to know. You never had a brain in the first place, Deb. I had to have a long talk with my doctor. You will find out tomorrow why. Or the, no, probably like Thursday or Friday. Because tomorrow's the announcement and the vlog, blah, 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 goes on. Okay. Well, so we're a few days behind. However. I had to have a long talk with him. You have to go to Hopeful why. Nation for that. If you go to Hopeful Nation tomorrow, you will know why today I had to have a long talk with my doctor. Love from India. All right. Thank you. I love this shirt so much. I love it too. I want to steal it. It is so warm. He has to buy me one now. So warm. So comfortable. I'm totally like into sweatshirts right at the moment. I was starting to collect more sweatshirts. Oh, mute. Oh, okay. So the winner of the... Okay, next Monday night. All right. I didn't anticipate they would already do a uh, yeah set up McIntyre yeah. for a... I thought maybe they were just doing it for show, but I guess they're doing it actually for the title. Yes, Dark Apollo. Uh, very, very sad. Very sad. Mel already, uh, you guys talked about it before I got here. Um, 
Yeah. I don't, hey, I don't, here's, the, here's the thing. I don't it. understand some of your comments, but that's okay. The man, his last match was so epic. His last match was the dog collar what? match with Cody Rhodes. Is so Paul Pan here? He will be remembered for such an amazing match, his final Thanks, one. Savannah. Where did I get this sweatshirt? Thanks, Rebecca. Well, I'll tell you if you email them and tell them I want to be a paid sponsor. What's up, Dylan? I actually, this is not a licensed WWE it's sweatshirt. Not, it's not a true one. It's just a, a made mock-up one. Uh, I actually bought this from Wish. Wish.com. Not a paid sponsor. I had to buy two sizes bigger than what I wear, and it fits perfect. Like I said, out of all the sweatshirts I own. That's what I'm saying, Adam. This is the most comfortable. I love it. It's got the pockets. It's got everything. And it came with uh, Thanks, sweatpants. Thanks, Deb, for posting the link. Savannah is faux fam. Got it. Wait. Are you the fan page of Faux Fam, Savannah? Yes, good riddance. But I saw that already, Courtney, and I said I was praying for your family. Yes, dear, we are praying. Uh, Ronnie Bell, buy Mel that sweatshirt. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate Why that. Why would we want to have Ronnie, matching buy me the sweatshirts. sweatshirts? Why? What if they have a black one? They do. They have a red one, too. Oh, I'll take the red one. I kind of knew beforehand that he was going to do all explain that in more detail if you want me to kind of <laughs> sponsor Hopeful Nation. Thank you, Adam. I appreciate that. Hi, Finally. Yvonne. Welcome, welcome. Thanks, Wally. Uh, by the Mel and Ronnie Christmas morning, I wear a draft shadow shirt. Awesome, Eric. Well, we, we do. We appreciate that. No, we love it when you guys wear Drac Shadow. It honors our son, and that is very important to us, and so we appreciate that. The dog collar match made Brody Lee a top star in the industry, in my opinion. No, Josh, you're right. That no. match was yeah. so crazy. Yeah. It was so amazing. He will be remembered. I mean, he had some great matches in WWE. But the skill set that he displayed in that dog collar match was so, I mean, even Cody. And they both complimented each other, so it just made it epic. Or, yeah, but Wish. Oh, iconic! But Wish shirts are way much cheaper than having custom-made shirts, though, because they are, what, how much was that, $12 or something like that? Less than? <laughs> Ron Wells asking for a friend. <laughs> <laughs> Ronwell wins comment of the night. Good one, Ronwell. I'll think about it. I'll think about it. <laughs> now you you have to I don't want her trumping me. <laughs> awesome, Savannah. Paul Heyman. I know, but on Paul Heyman. Gross. It's a it's it's bad. It is bad, I agree. So would Cody have Brody to Really? My friends and I are trying to spread the words about the late, great Drag Shadow. Well, Punk, we love you. So thank you. Appreciate that so very Dad, much. You don't get a vote. Things that are iconic need to be spoken. Mm -hmm. You guys watch AEW? Uh, Absolutely yes. Of course we do. Uh, yeah. I mean, Cody Rhodes. He's Cody Rhodes is one of our great friends, so <laughs> we have to support it. The reason I bring this up is because a similar thing happened to my aunt when she passed only because it was breathing. Wow, Victor, that's crazy. Yes, we have two of them. We have the one. One is in the case right there, and I'll show you the other one. What's up, Skylar Sodolik? I heard Vince McMahon is at home. Get better. I hope he's doing okay. But I'm not going to pull out my spinner right, the spinner right now. But, I mean, these are actually Elijah's belts, so... I didn't, I didn't get these. Stephanie gave gave these to him, but obviously we can. 
The real one in the case, we will not, not pull out, but we pull this one out. That's the real one uh, Drag Shadow got from Stephanie McMahon when he got in the ring and signed a contract. That's the one up there. And then when he... We went to it. We went backstage again sometime, and for whatever reason, he forgot one. He for he we didn't bring it. Yeah, we didn't bring it to a show, and she wanted to heavy. see it, and so she's like, "Here, here's a backup one." And we're like, "Oh." So this okay. is the one you can buy on WWE.com. Yeah, but those ones are expensive too, though. Oh yeah, this like that thing's four hundred or whatever. something like that, three to four hundred dollars for something. Like and that. I still and I do have the spinner. Um, you know what? I don't know about Vince. Uh, if he's at home, I, I believe you. I just said, I hope he's doing okay. Keith Lee just totally smashed Seamus. What's so for what, supper? Homemade uh, bacon mac and cheese. Homemade. It's the cheesiest of the cheesiest of the cheesiest mac and cheese. But I have to go start the noodles here in a second. So I'm going to leave you with Ronnie for a minute. Since he left me alone. Yeah, Savannah. Paul Heyman needs to leave WWE. He's not good for the business, honestly. Nobody likes him. Yes, I saw the star of Bethlehem last week, Courtney. And I just saw that you deleted. But I did see it. The star of Bethlehem was very really cool to see. Where's the signed belt from the wrestlers? Do We don't have a signed we have belt. One. We wouldn't let them sign the no. real belt. No, no. And they signed other things like pictures stuff, and posters yeah. and things like that and cards and stuff. Nice. I want. Yeah, you know what? The only time you should ever buy a replica belt is during a holiday because I've seen them 50% off. And I wish I would have bought mine then. What's up, 101 Ken? How are you doing? I still would like to get the Eagle. I really like that belt. Plain Rocks, that would be crazy. I don't know if that'll ever happen because WWE owns the Stardust name. But that would be crazy. Your yeah. ham hamburgers and potatoes sound good. You ate yes, you did, Deb. Yes, you did. Well, okay, I'm going to go start some noodles for the mac and cheese. You guys chat with Ronnie. I will be right back. You see, Miss Debs ate a lot of chocolate for specific reasons. She was live and uh, every time she got bits donated, she had to eat chocolate. Sorry. Uh, so yeah, she had to eat a lot of chocolate. Look at how much dust is on this belt. I gotta go fix that. Be like, hold it. You know what? The smoke and skull, uh, Austin's belt, that would be, you know what? She wants the women's, uh. I mean, there's so many belts I want, and who knows? Who knows? I want the old Intercontinental uh, belt because uh, Macho Man had it. Also, Hogan and Macho Man had the had the the original Eagle. I want that one. Ah, you know what? I don't personally care for either. They're all right. They're all right. Uh, I guess I would have to say red just because of Elijah's color. It's not a SmackDown. It's not a Raw. It's not any of that. But it's just, uh, you know, red is one of Elijah's colors. So awesome, Skyler. Well, he is an amazing, amazing man. Um, I like what they're doing with uh, Elias, too. He doesn't need a bodyguard, but I'm so glad he's back. Amber wants the SmackDown Women's Championship. That's what Mel wants. The, Smack the Women's Championship. 
Yeah, but I really want the U.S. spinner belt. Is that, I don't even know if that's for sale, Amber, is it? I don't think I've seen that one on WWE Shop, or maybe I just wasn't looking. Cassidy has the Raw Women's. And I wouldn't mind getting the old Divas one either, just to have it and put it on the wall. If I ever come into some money, I'm going to get me some more belts. It, I would love that. Get the NWO belt. Oh, yes. From Alberta. Thank you, Kristen. Well, we appreciate you stopping by. Drew versus Edge versus the weird Paul Heyman with the Roman Reigns with a ponytail. <laughs> I, I don't know where they're going with this. Yeah, Roman's top dog, but are they waiting for uh, Jimmy to be off of uh, injury? What are they doing? Why ain't both Usos back? And why ain't they building the franchise? Uh, they're kind of playing it out. I don't know. I hope they have a plan and they're building up to it. Did you guys see the... Uh, I forgot his name. Somebody's going to have to help me. Uh, uh, I just forgot his name. Uh, Reigns is, Roman Reigns' is cousin, who unofficially, I'm hearing he signed with AEW. He took a picture in front of the AEW uh, poster. I, I don't know why his name is escaping me right now. So, yeah, somebody yell at Dean, please. How's life going for you? It, you know what? It's all right. I've been off for a couple weeks. I've been doing a lot around the house. You'll hear about that tomorrow on Hopeful Nation. Uh... I thought we did too. No, I mean, I would think that's the only reason why is that Jimmy isn't cleared yet. Wait, why you guys keep saying Jay? No, Jimmy's the one that's hurt. Alpha Jr.? No, but that's... No, what's his name? Victor... Charlene, Hitman, Josh, somebody, Amber, help me out. It's right there. No, I don't know much about it. Is it? Why can't I think of his name? Yeah, because he ain't that popular besides the fact that he's he's Samoan and is related to The Rock and uh, uh, All right, mac and Rain. cheese is started. Oh, did I? Okay, well, I'm sorry. Well, they are cousins. Come on. Only Dean's allowed to... Um, Promote his Twitch because he's a friend of ours and patron, so only certain people are allowed to promote that. You know what, Victor? I, I don't. Yeah, it's. Hi, David. It kind of belittles AJ a little bit. I was all right with it, but they're not doing nothing with it. If he's just going to be his bodyguard, I don't understand. He either needs to turn on him. What did your or family get for him? Christmas, AJ? Is it? It's Lance. Why do I feel cold air? Yeah, but what? What's his ring name? What's up, Ryan Greenwood? How are you doing? Good to see you. Yes, you, you know what? They just they just showed that. I'd love to see Sergeant Slaughter again. Mm. 
let me go to. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, let me go to my YouTube channel on my phone here. Yes, you should. Ronnie should get the Hulk Hogan Hulkamania belt. I agree 110%. What? Not Dark uh, Apollo, right. I'm good, thank you. Merry Christmas to you, Ryan. Did you have a good Christmas? Um. Also, Ryan, and all those that are just joining along, we have a new channel that you can comment on. It's called Hopeful Nation. The moderators will post the YouTube link. You can go over and subscribe to Hopeful Nation. You could go on over there. We're vlogging over Lance there. Lance Annoy. And you can comment. Thank you. Okay, Lance Annoy. Anna Y. Maybe it's Anna Y. I don't remember. But I'm sure we'll find out real soon. His name is Jay. Okay, so Victor says, no, it's Lance. Jimmy still hurt. The only reason they used him for that. Good, I'm glad. Oh, I'm so happy you got Disney Plus. How exciting. I love Disney Plus. I hope you're watching The Mandalorian. Watch The Mandalorian. Yeah, you know what, Wally? I We do... You know, like the stuff that Walmart has, it's the, I don't know. I'm kind of stuck on official gear and uh, we haven't got official gear in months because uh, we haven't had the money, but hopefully here soon Dark we'll be Apollo, able to. Dark Apollo, our Christmas is very nice and peaceful and quiet. We've just been keeping it on the down low. Nothing special, nothing huge. If you watch the vlog today, I was a little, I don't want to say quiet, but I was having a hard time, but I got through it. We are not posting the Christmas vlog until Thursday, Ronnie. I thought I watched it today. Tom, you did while I was editing it. Well, either way, when you do see it, <laughs> if I'm a little quiet. Today was the Mayhem Monday tissue. If I'm melancholy, it's because I was trying to get through not having Elijah. Right. And, uh. I did the best I could. Yes, a nightmare for before Christmas. Yes, you need a slam crate. Yes, we need to do some more slam crate on this channel. I love WWE slam crate. Yes, Ryan, we did hear it first thing when it first happened yesterday. Was it yesterday or the day before? When Brody? Yeah. Yeah. T Live are doing great. Uh, we're always in contact with them. We talk to them almost every day. The Hogan Watch, huh? The ch yes, the, it was the Tissue Challenge on Hopeful Nation. If you go watch, we have a Mayhem Monday Challenge. And then Ronnie talks about being at his work for 25 years. Oh, Courtney, I'm so happy we can make you laugh and smile. Yes, Wayne, it's about freaking time after six years. What? We're not all about the, the Miz loss. clout, but we're all about the community, and you guys are family to us. So that's important to me. Brazil. I can't see. As a Azaline, I can't read it. I'm blind. Uh, Azaline, Azaline, maybe. Azaline. Hello from Brazil. Hello from California. No, Dean, the, the WWE Slam crates come with official gear. Okay, it's like Loot Crate. Ever heard of Loot Crate or like a monthly subscription unboxing that people do on YouTube? I don't know if you've ever heard of you anybody. You some sort of, say, like a shirt or a towel I or almost a gave away head. the announcement. I almost said something that would have given away the announcement. But soon I do want to do a Walt Disney unboxing, monthly unboxing. Uh-oh. Yeah, hopefully we can get back into that Dark Apollo. I know, 600. Does Amazon have Cody shirts? Yes, Valerie, I think they do. You could probably get them cheaper somewhere, even like Hot Topic. I wonder if possibly. AEW sells yes, they merch. Do. I'm going to have to AEW look on shop. I'm going to have to look on AEW and look. Thanks, Ryan. 
Exciting. Welcome to the Hopeful Nation family over there. Yes, no, seriously, Ms. Lost. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, seriously. Which the, video did you the get? The dude had the money in the bank and he just lost. Um, it was the last vlog. Friday's vlog? Did I post it on this last Friday? I don't remember. There's so much footage, I don't remember. We did. I At my doctor today, we actually discussed it for a brief minute. About what? The new COVID strain. Yeah. There's two more COVID strains. Hi, Litri. Litri. Ew, you guys suck. Oh, you're so special. You're so important. <laughs> One of my favorite tag teams right now. Or women's tag teams. Literally, 12 year olds say that. So if you're 12, grow up. Ronnie and Mel are, are going to announce that they are awesome and they already know that. Adam, okay, yeah, yeah no. You know what, Anthony? The boogeyman would get annihilated, though, by the team. Yes, I think it was the last vlog before today's. Yes, I think it was the Friday's. Okay, check on my food. Caden, uh, will you go mix the noodles, please? Mainville, sorry, I'm chatting with you so much. I want to watch the Walt Disney Lion King 1984. Oh, of course I did. I went to the Thank movie you, theaters, Courtney Cunningham. I went to the movie theaters and I watched it in the theaters. Lion King is one of my number one favorite all time movies. I was 14 years old when it came out. They don't even have to call them blonde, they can just call but them bombshells. What kind of question is that? You know, I'm a Disney fanatic. <laughs> I've watched all movies except for maybe some new ones. Tier four lockdown, you can't go out at all. That's Ugh. oh, that's horrifying. The the whole co the hundred and thirty three bucks. That's cheap. That is cheap. I'm thinking four to five hundred dollars for something like that. Oh, thanks, Wayne. At least I think it's cheap, but I'd have to look at it. You know, is it is it uh what's the word? Why did the one to one boogeyman never win belts or get the big push? Because he was, he was too weird. I think Elijah loved the Boogeyman, though. Elijah loved the weird characters. He would probably love uh, Bray Wyatt's new character, uh, oh, the he Fiend. Would. He would. He would have been freaking out about the Fiend. Elijah loved the awkward. That's why he loved the Undertaker and Stardust, and he he was totally into that. He was into Five Nights at Freddy's, Freddy Fazbear. You know, so Elijah was into that stuff. So he, he took was, he takes after me. I was all totally into horror stuff. <laughs> the Boogeyman was just. He was the next level. I thought Papa Shango was bad. And then I got I got into his character before they canned it. No, the movie theaters are not open here. Uh, but no, he's a, he's a new level. Like, uh, I forget her name I now. did watch Mary Poppins Return. Who's the zombie chick on AEW? Uh, uh, more, not morbid. Uh, oh, what's her name? Angie Harris. Hello, welcome. Sorry, you guys are on a lag and you guys will see this later. Like, I think you guys are about a good 30 seconds behind us. Well, Victor, we have a lot. And you know, the only reason why we haven't bought them. Dude, I love the boogeyman. I think he was pretty cool. No, I mean, he's all right. I just, yeah. Yeah. Yes, Wally, we are not giving away the surprise right now. Just keep it hush hush until tomorrow. Thank you. What yes, do you he would. He would have wanted, one? Drax would have wanted the doggone uh, uh, lantern, too. Caden, what do you call a grumpy reindeer? What? Rude off. <laughs> ah, <laughs> that was a good one, Amanda. Yeah, he would have, Eric. Yep, definitely. No, it's not Amanda. It's the best in the world and your new champion. Amanda's her name? No, the zombie chick on AEW? No. It's... Amber even said it was Amanda. It's not her name. Her stage name, you mean? Yes. Not her real name, her stage no, name. No, stage name. Her real name's Amanda, but what it was her stage name? It's uh Anthony, I honestly do not care about football at the moment. Not 
not saying that in a mean way. I'm just not watching football. <laughs> so, uh, oh yes, Angie, you are correct. No fear. I'm scared to death. My heart's just pounding, pounding, pounding. He just walks up like nothing's up. Nothing's up. But Anthony, thank you for keeping me updated. I appreciate it. Interesting. We answered. That's not her name. It's so interesting to me that we answer these questions and yet they repeat the question. Are you not hearing us? Yes, we I'm do just watch curious. NXT. So for the for, so the first thing I thought about when I heard about Brody passing was Elijah waking uh, walking up to him. We all thought about that exact moment, Angie. That moment when he walked up and grabbed Luke Harper's back and just started talking to him like he was one of the guys. Like. That was the moment I thought of when that happened. Exactly. Yes, we watch NXT. I think he just answered that. We watch AEW before NXT, though. Bye, Jared. Ronnie, are you fixing stuff around the house, handyman? No, I'm Nobody's, organizing. Yes, we are minimalizing in our house right now. We are binging, and those vlogs are coming up as well. So, yes, he's doing a lot. Oh, thanks, Courtney. Oh, a slap to man. Uh, to... Okay, Victor. I feel like some of you guys are way behind us. That's so weird. Yeah. Is Abaddon Abaddon? Abaddon. There we go. Abaddon. Who Somebody said answered it? that a while back. I think Ephraim. Thank answered you, it. Amber. Ephraim answered it as Did well. It... Abaddon. Abaddon. Is it Abaddon? What is. What name is Abaddon. the most condescending? Amanda. That chick is Amanda. Scary. Hello, Miss Bliss. Abandon. Randy is a deserving universal champion. Is it we're not talking about Randy Orton? Uh Randy Orton, he's been a champion multiple times. Uh, do we have any tips of asking a girl out? It's been over 20 years. <laughs> I don't ask women out, but I guess he can give tips. I will give you the number one tip I could give you. Look into her eyes. Not anywhere else. I, why do guys do that? What do you look into her eyes? Men have hi hypnotic. Oh my gosh, no. That's look, so, that's horrible. Look into don't her eyes. Don't creep her out. Just don't creep her out. Don't be a creepy creep. <laughs> no, but look into your look into her eyes. Show your best yes. Banana. The boogeyman versus the fiend. I would like to see that. That would be a great fight. I would like to see that. That's awesome, Angie. Oh geez. People will do anything to try to destroy other people's lives. Welcome to social media. Yep, they're keyboard warriors, but they yes. wouldn't do it in person. Oh, I'm sure somebody will find something absolutely horrifying about us and say something really bad about us one day. I this just, sucks. I see it coming. I, I just love Shayna. I love Brooke. You know Shayna's going to win. Yeah, Ryan, just don't be weird. <laughs> Deb's got it. Uh, Deb's uh, could tell you some things not to do. Who is the tallest? I'm going to say Kane. Yeah, calm down, Mr. Hypnotize. Kane was taller than, than <laughs> Mel, Braun. Mel, look into her eyes. Nowhere else. <laughs> Do we like You guys Megan? are way behind. It's like a minute behind. Can you imagine that if AJ Styles versus CM Punk at WrestleMania this AJ year? AJ would crush him. Yep. CM Punk is a... <clears throat> There is a rumor that Eva Marie is coming back. Is that true? Yeah. Well, yes. Yes, it is true. Just don't know when. She has signed. Is she signed for purely backstage? Has she signed with NXT? Or are they waiting for like a rumble to bring her back? I thought she was already coming back. Adam. He only is allowed to say it's disgusting after 20 years. He lied to me the first 20 years and said it was delicious. So. So. <laughs> I don't, Dark Apollo, I don't think that's going to happen. What did he say? 
Wait, what? Where? Huh? Can you? Oh, no. I No, it would not happen. I can tell you that it would not. That, that would just be a dream match. It will not happen. See, that's the same with Stardust, Victor. Stardust just kept on getting pushed back and back. And Cody Rhodes had so many great ideas. And they wouldn't let him do the ideas. And that was very upsetting for Cody. I mean, there's multiple other things. Can you grab yeah. a joke, please? I'm going to go check on the noodles. Hello, Miss Joan Curry. Joan is in the house. Joan, where do you live again? I forgot. Tell me where she lives All when right. she answers. Joan, make sure you catch the vlog tomorrow on Where's Hopeful Nation. Okay. What is for dinner? Uh, some cheesy nonsense. I will eat enough of it so I don't subject Caden to certain violations of his stomachness. So I'll try to eat most of it to bear Caden the punishment. Um, well, you know, our situation's way different because... We, I'm talking to the hopefuls right now. Uh, because we had to live. Because I'm going to eat some of it. Well, then I'll save it tomorrow and heat it back up. Uh, our life was so different that we had to travel so much and live at hospitals and eat that kind of food. Mel was never able to cook. Uh, so we're, our situation is a little different. Now that we got over the initial hard part of losing Elijah, and then things got back to normal, she could actually uh, concentrate on being a, I was going to say wife, cook, cook. She's yelling at me, cook. Yeah, cheesy nonsense. <laughs> um. Motion. Well, then come sit down, buddy. Hello, friend. Hello, friend. What do you call always wanting a date for New Year's Eve? A day or date? Date. What do you call for always want? What do you call it for always wanting a date on New Year's Eve? Social security. Social security. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Not all of you get that, but that is kind of funny. Next one. Why should you put your new calendar in the freezer? Why should you put your new calendar in the freezer? <clears throat> no idea. No start idea. Start off the new year in a cool way. Start off the new year in a cool way. That was very cheesy, but I like it. It made sense. Okay. I wish. Um, you know what? I originally, but I mean, I've always loved wrestling. Okay, there was a a short time where I got into boxing. I had some really close friends before we started uh, vlogging. Before we had kids, uh, he almost went. Uh, to the Olympics for boxing. Uh, I played softball with him. He's actually a pastor. In, yeah, and junior. Um, they're a whole boxing family. Uh, where does uh, Mitchell pastor? Clear, Clear Lake, California. Clear Lake, California. He's a pastor. He has his own church out there. There's big boxing fans. Uh, we would fight and argue about wrestling versus boxing yeah but you know you could knock me out but if you don't knock me out and i get you to the ground it's all over and of course i liked ufc when it uh before it went underground then it came back up and i like ufc i don't watch it enough i used to get together with a couple guys from work and we would split the pay-per-view and do a ufc party and then just things, ha wrestling, I think, is just so much more appealing. And life goes on, yeah. Uh, 
I'm not paying $70 for a pay-per-view for either have a boring fight or a 10-second fight because I stopped doing that yeah, when that uh, when Tyson uh, knocked out. I paid $69 for, we're talking years ago, before, way before, I wasn't even married, I'm not sure. Tyson Tyson fought Haseem Rockman, who was the champion. It was after Tyson got out of prison. And he beat him in like eight seconds. It wasn't even, he hit him once and he hit him so doggone hard. Um, but I do, I love boxing. Uh, but wrestling's number one. And I don't know, drama mean? I don't know what's best for, don't look at your pad or your phone, close your eyes. Uh, motion sickness. Yeah, I guess anti-nausea. Uh, yeah, well, unfortunately, you're not going to see. I don't like necessarily exactly how they're, how they split them up. Excuse me. But I'm going to give them some more time. Yeah, Eric, I mean. I was so pumped for that fight, and everybody said Tyson was a has-been and all this, and uh, it just, well, it is what it is. Okay, where are we at? 2 a.m., Dean. Oh, my goodness. Go get some sleep, buddy. Yes, it has been an hour. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, Victor. We'll see Eva Marie probably get down in the rumble. Uh, get down. That would be my take on it. I thought they were gonna do it uh, a different way when she posted the rose, but for whatever reason, they uh, they didn't go that route. So I'm not exactly sure what they're going to do, but we'll see. I I love Eva Marie. I can't wait for, I thought she was a very underrated talent, but you know, it is what it is. Thank you, Dr. Apollo. I appreciate it. All right, Mel will be back here in just a second. Ryan, thank you so much. Yes, he was. Yes, Kathy, we do watch TV. I'm the main guy that watches TV. I don't watch TV. I live stream. I have shows that Did I watch. The Alexa, the Alexa house? I guess I didn't. It's on right now. Oh, you mean her playground? Yeah. Okay, guys. We're going to have to say goodbye. Um, make sure you go over to Hopeful Nation to find out our announcement. We have a huge announcement tomorrow. It's kind of Holy already given shit. away as a per title, but it's not clickbait. It is absolutely not clickbait. It is real. It is happening. It'll be on at 10 a.m. our time tomorrow morning. Make Pacific. sure you get yeah, Pacific Standard Time. Make sure you watch our announcement at Hopeful Nation. Um, click on the links that the moderators are posting. That's where it'll take you to Hopeful Nation. Also, we will definitely have more videos here. I definitely want to get him some WWE stuff going on. I have so, to ask you something. What? Tell me they didn't do a tribute to Luke Harper. They did it at the very beginning. They did. They did. They did a 30-second ordeal, but nobody came out and walked out. They just showed a picture and said RAP pretty much. So. All right, guys. I wasn't sure if they're going to be allowed to. Uh, not that they didn't want to, but they weren't going to be allowed to. Uh, but what it is what it is. Hey, love and hugs, guys. Love you. We'll tell next time. You.